I forwarded the mission update to the Citadel commander. We got confirmation on those reinforcements. Ambassador Udino wants us to report back to the Citadel. The Council's massing a joint species fleet to deal with Saren and his Geth. I knew they'd come around. Back to the Citadel, Joker. I want the Normandy at the head of that fleet. Yes, sir. Good job, Shepard. Thanks to you, the Council's finally taking real action against Saren. The Ambassador is correct. If Saren is foolish enough to attack the Citadel, as you believe, we will be ready for him. Patrols are stationed at every mass relay linking Citadel space to the Terminus systems. How many ships are you sending to attack Ilos? Ilos is only accessible to the Mule Relay, deep inside the Terminus systems, Commander. If we send a fleet in there, the only possible outcome is full-scale war. Now is the time for discretion, Commander. Saren's greatest weapon was secrecy. Exposed, he is no longer a threat. This is over. One ship going into the Terminus systems won't start a war. I can be discreet. You detonated a nuclear device on Vermeer. I wouldn't call that discreet. Your style served you well in the Traverse, Commander. We recognize that. But Ilos requires a deft touch. We have the situation under control. If Saren finds the conduit, we're all screwed. We have to go to Ilos. Ambassador Udina, I get the sense Commander Shepard isn't willing to let this go. There are serious political implications here, Shepard. Humanity's made great gains thanks to you, but now you're becoming more trouble than you're worth. You bastard! You're selling us out! It's just politics, Commander. You've done your job, now let me do mine. We've locked out all the Normandy's primary systems until further notice you're grounded. Are you insane? After everything I've done, you still don't believe me? I think it's time for you and your team to leave, Commander. This no longer concerns you. The Council can handle this, with my help, of course. Commander. Shepard. I cannot believe they did this to you. I am so sorry. It's not your fault. It's not right. You did everything they asked and more. Nobody else could have done what you did. The Council owes you everything. Everything. Instead, they strip you of your command and ground the Normandy. I don't care if they ground me, but they refuse to go after Saren. If they don't stop him from finding the conduit, we're all dead. Perhaps we could appeal, and get them to reverse their decision. I pushed them as hard as I could. They wouldn't budge. So you're going to walk away? You will just give up and doom the entire galaxy to extinction? We're out of the game for now, but I'll find a way back in. I believe in you, Shepard. I am with you every step of the way. Sorry to interrupt, Commander. Got a message from Captain Anderson. What did he want? Only said to meet him in that club in the wards. Flux. You should probably go meet with him. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Admiral Kahoku, a respected member of the Alliance military, has passed away. The veteran soldier who won the love of his troops during conflict with the Batarians died of natural causes. 
Kahoku is survived by his wife and three children who are planning a small private memorial service. Why were you tossed out of there? Doran didn't have a clue what I was doing. He, he assumed I was cheating. I know Doran. If he says you're cheating, you're cheating. I was just tipping the scales in my favor, only as an experiment. It still sounds like cheating to me. To you, maybe. But this advice is merely intended to simulate situations and record results. Recording losses is easy, of course. Nobody notices those. Why do you need to record these outcomes? Ah, now you're getting to the heart of it. I've spent the last five years developing a system that can accurately predict wins and losses on the Quasar. I just need a few more recorded wins and I can complete the algorithms. Can you do that? Isn't that illegal? It's illegal to use my system, but I won't use it. I'll sell it to others. I just need a few more wins recorded. I think I'll take my chances the old-fashioned way. Hmm. Suit yourself. Well, I have some calculations to do. Goodbye. Soldier, I've got a major situation, and I need help from somebody with humanity's interests at heart. It's Commander, actually. What do you want? Of course, right to business. That's why humanity has the best damn fleet in the galaxy. My name is Elias Keeler. I'm an Alliance negotiator. We've got a big session coming up with the Solarians. You wouldn't believe what's riding on this. I'm fighting for humanity on this one, just like you are. Don't try to sell me on this. Just tell me what you want. I need you to buy a mental stimulant for me. It's legal, but restricted. I've purchased the monthly limit, and I need more from the medbay. Healer, you've got a problem. You need to get treatment. Might look that way from the outside, but this is just a one-time slip-up. All the top negotiators are on stimulants close to the legal limit. It's the way the game is played. Will overdosing on stimulants and getting arrested help humanity, Healer? Maybe you're right. I've been trying to keep humanity strong, and maybe I've pushed myself too hard. I'll tell you what, this will be the last time I use the stimulant. After this deal is finished, I'll get treatment. No trade negotiation is worth ruining your life for. Let it go and get help. You don't understand! Humanity needs me, and I need that stimulant! Without it, I'll... I... I don't know anymore. I get so tired when I run out of the stimulant, I... I just need one more boost. There's no shame in having a problem, but you have to get treatment. You're, you're right. Uh, I'll go tell my assistant. I shouldn't be working like this. I, I'll, I'll get help. I'm just sorry it came to this. Jenna came back looking for work. Thanks for getting her out of Cora's den. I was glad to help out. Yeah, everyone seems real happy to have her back. I sense that you are less than pleased with her return. I'm glad she's out of the den. I'd just forgotten what it was like to have her around. I haven't had a decent tip since she got back. Glad you came, Shepard. I heard what happened. They pulled me off the mission. Just like when they forced you to give up the Normandy. I know, I'm sorry. I wanted to warn you, but there was no way to get a message to you before you docked. I know you're pissed off right now, but you can't give up. They all think this is over, but we both know it's not. You have to go to Ilos. You have to stop Saren from using the conduit. 
There's only one ship that can get me into the Terminus systems undetected, and she's grounded. Citadel controls locked out all the Normandy systems, but if we override the Ambassador's orders, we can get them to bring the Normandy back online. You can be in the Terminus systems before anyone even knows you're gone. What's the plan? I can unlock the Normandy from one of the consoles in the Citadel Control Center. You'll have a few minutes before anyone realizes what happened. That's a restricted area patrolled by armed guards. How are you going to get in? Leave that to me. Just make sure you're in the Normandy when the systems come back online. There's got to be a better way. Ambassador Udina issued the lockdown order. If I can hack into the computer in his office, maybe I can override it. He will not just stand by while you use his computer. Hopefully he won't be there. If he is, I'll just have to think of something. The Ambassador will not forgive this, Captain. You will be charged with treason, a capital offense. We don't have a lot of options. I break into the Ambassador's computer, or I take my chances with the patrols in Citadel Control. It's your call, Captain. I'll break into the Ambassador's office. He made this personal. You ready to get the hell off this station, Commander? Let's do it. I'll take care of the lockdown. You get down to the Normandy and tell Joker to stand by. Kalisa Algelani recently attempted to land an interview with Commander Shepard, the first human specter. Commander Shepard answered difficult questions, demonstrating that under that military uniform is a keen diplomatic mind. We'll have exclusive footage later today. Shore party. Decontamination in progress. Anderson? What are you doing here? I didn't send. Mm. Get us out of here, Joker. Now! 